Ready? Once it starts going in. Alright, everybody, it's Sorry Tag and Zephyr here commentating Sir Spud versus Rubidan. Rubidan? Rubidan. Rubidan. Which Dan? <laughs> Which Dan? That's what we've got. Rubidan actually playing Scizor, a secondary of Spud. And Spud, of course, playing Gengar. Right, so we've got. Gengar is zoning out right there. Dives kicked right. right into that CA. Oh yeah. Ooh. All right. Yo. Okay. All right. Nice combo there by Riven. Riven. Metal claw. I actually don't know this matchup. Do All I? right, Rubidan is doing a great job spacing out. Tries to go for that OP grab on the knockdown, but gets Spud, does get, Spud does get hit by that. Or Spud does connect that. Calls in the Pachirisu. Spud knowing full aware what gets, what gets taken out by Pachirisu. So he's pushing this Gengar in the corner and just keeping them right there. Staying out of zone from every single grab. Goes in the cover dash grab. Yeah. Wait, is it? Caesar getting those staples down to go for the guard break setup, and a grab will take round one. Wait, is... No, Rubidan's playing Gengar, right? Are you playing Gengar? Okay. Oh. Rubidan is playing We're Gengar. Up, Spud is playing Scizor right now. My bad. Our bad, yeah. I got it mixed up. My apologies, folks. I got it completely mixed up. Change the program, no, sis. So, yes, Sir Spud is sizzling. Okay. Sir Spud getting punished out of there with that 6x. Yep. Uh, 6yy. 6yx. No, 6yy. Alright. Laying down corner pressure. Right. Mistimes that grab. Gets punished with his own grab. Does it disappear enough time? Oh, oh, that grab with the burst. Got nicked by that burst there. I think that'll be game one going to Sir Spud. Wow. Uh, no jump zone, buddy. You, you can't. You can't. Uh, you can't just jump willy nilly. I mean, you can jump forward and work it up. I mean, you can jump forward, but then you know. You just don't. Can't. You just need to be next to him. Yeah. The only time. The only. There's that. There's the blind spot there. There is a blind spot. Yes. But when you're at that mid range, just don't. Play. No. It's, it's like I don't care if you're Gengar and you have Shadow C. Yeah. I'll give you that. Um. All right. Going into game. Sir going in with those CADCs. He gets his grab. What counter? Okay. Six by one. Move Dan getting this nice sweet combo. Get that astonishing. Goes for the only non one hit uh, attack that Gengar has in field phase. By the way, fun fact you can uh, perfect block everything Gengar does besides that charge block, charge fair line. Because everything he does is one hit. Nice combo. Shifting him back into field phase, getting that meter up, taking him with the staples and hitting them with the uh, metal ball there. Nice, yeah, he punches him the next way. Spud not having a wall. Yep, I know Paul will do it. Alright. Not even having to go into the air to beat. Oh, sorry, Gengar there. This is Matt, this is set point for Sir Spud right now. Ooh, oh my gosh! I thought he got out of those staples doing that. That was almost, that was actually really clever. Oh yeah. You get the tornado though. Just get grabbed though. Alright, going for another guard break, denying Gengar any kind of uh, meter right there. Oh yeah. Go for the grab, confirm. Give himself a lot of health and synergy. So he pretty much makes everything back that he had lost from uh, to, uh, guard break. Ooh, nice homing attack there. You can continue it, not confident enough that would hit. Nice tornado. Tries to go for Stone. It doesn't work. Sir Spud is kind of trying to go for that Shadow Sneak grab there. No dice. Gengar pulling out the Mega. Metal Claw. He's going to have to utilize 
Ooh, tries to grab that. The tornado doesn't reach him. Total kiss for, total kiss for some speed. Yep, that will be a punish. Alright, and gets the bullet punches. Well, multiple punches. I'll call it Comet Punch. There we go. Alright, Spud will take this 2-0. Not a bad, um, not a bad job.